Welcome to Salesforce Training. In this demonstration, we're going to learn about the Chatter Collaboration Tool built into Salesforce that allows you to communicate with other team members and post relevant messages, files, and activities in Salesforce records or groups. On the home screen, there's a Chatter feed that will show you the most recent updates in Chatter that are relevant to you and the records you follow. The feed displays the most recent comments, updates, and posts. The full Chatter feed is located in the Chatter tab on the navigation menu. The Chatter tab is organized to help you filter messages that are important to you by the six sections on the left column. What I follow combines all the feeds from all the people and things you follow. If you have a question, you can post it in the Chatter feed and it will be available for anyone that follows you or any group or user that you mention. The poll feature lets you get input from your team by providing them the opportunity to respond to a question with specific answers that you choose. The results of the poll will remain stored in the record and comments can be added at any time. To me, combines all the posts where you're mentioned, provided you have access to the feeds where they're posted. Bookmark combines all the posts that you've saved for later viewing. Company Highlights uses the Einstein artificial intelligence to do a little relevance ranking in the background. It brings you a ranked view of what's trending in your org and top posts. Streams are super feeds that you create by combining the records, people, and groups you want to follow together. And Recent Groups shows a list of the top five most recently updated groups that you're a member. The bell icon on the top of the page shows you in-app notifications of the number of unread messages that you have. Click the bell to see notifications where you're mentioned, who's commenting on your post, and who's posting to your groups. You manage who and what you follow in Chatter and can easily review who is following you and your Chatter posts when you click on your profile. Chatter stores all files posted in either groups or records for easy retrieval. Let's look at how a Chatter feed works inside an account record. Each record will filter the Chatter feed for all posts related to this record. This provides a detailed history of the questions, comments, or changes to the account record for your review anytime you view that record. You can mark a message to a specific user or group in Chatter by entering the at symbol and the person or group's name. That user receives a chatter notification and knows which specific record you are referring to. This feature adds clarity to your communication and avoids those long email exchanges to determine a specific record when communicating outside of Salesforce. If you receive a chatter message in your email based on your personal email preferences, you can simply reply to that email and it will post automatically in chatter. No need to go to Salesforce to post your reply. When you go back to that record in Salesforce, the reply will show in the chatter feed. Let's switch to the mobile experience and see how chatter operates on the mobile application. As you can see, the mobile app opens in the chatter feed so you can see the latest updates. When you click the menu icon, you can choose any object and access the feed on any record. Let's look at how the Chatter feed works within an account record on the mobile application. The Chatter feature in an account is located in the Feed tab. You can leave notes and collaborate with other employees, track and sort key information, and resolve customer issues when cases become available for use. Overall, the use of Chatter will result in better organization, less email, less clutter, greater productivity, and ultimately, happier customers and contacts. Go to the Salesforce CRM Connections community for more videos, user guides, and support.